I'm Jennifer Angel. Hi Leo, this is my forecast for you for the week of August the 22nd. Now the sun departs your sign uh, early in the week, moves to the next uh, sign. Now this area of your chart is solar second house to do with money, possessions and material wealth. Also very much to do with how worthy you feel of attracting what you want in life, particularly around finances and uh, security. Now we've got, uh, so the sun moves in, Venus is also here, um, which is planet of love and money. It's a great position for Venus to be in. And um, Mercury, the communication planet, and Jupiter. Now Jupiter is going to be here just for another couple of weeks. Uh, so this is a great time, very opportunistic time where things can come through for you. Your hard work really can be rewarded during this next couple of weeks. And particularly as this week we have two very favorable beneficial aspects with Jupiter. Now let's look at Jupiter. Jupiter is a planet of abundance and expansion. It's like growth and uh, knowledge uh, and personal and spiritual growth as well. So um, the start of the week we have a conjunction with Jupiter and um, Mercury. Now Mercury being the communication planet. Now conjunction is when we've got the two planets at the exact same degree and the same location. Okay, so it's a spark of energy. It's really, uh, you know, positive, very positive sort of trigger and spark of energy. And right at the end of the week, over the weekend, Venus and Jupiter are going to conjunct, which is my personal favorite aspect um, all year round okay uh, so this is very very nice time now the one thing that you do need to take into consideration both with Venus and Jupiter is both of these vibrations really work better with a positive sort of outlook and attitude so um, and I mean of course it doesn't everything and you Leo you like to be positive you operate better on that level but you know sometimes if you think about what we want and we think about what we don't want then the result is the same but when we think about what we want and that has a greater attraction force it goes out on a higher vibration okay so both of these energies of Venus and Jupiter particularly out of all the other planets really operate better on this level so keep that in mind for this week uh, but it's always really but for, particularly for this ne next couple of weeks now we do have some aspects with Mars um, one is Mars will square uh, Neptune so and this is going to be um, if you're, it's almost sets up a little bit of an authority thing. You want to be careful that, firstly, that you don't tread on anyone's toes. Secondly, that you don't take anything for granted, okay? There could be some secrets or some information that's happening behind the scenes that hasn't been revealed to you yet. So there does seem to be, with this aspect, more to come. Now, uh, and the other aspect this week is that Mars and Saturn are going to conjunct. Now this is an area of connections, um, also creativity. It's like with the Saturn and Mars, they're opposite energies. Mars is like impulsive and Saturn is cautious. So there's some conflict going on there. So you want to be patient and tolerant, okay? All right, so love and luck to you. I hope you have a great week. Thanks for watching.